Making phone calls. Making inquiries. Hello, how may I help you today? Hi, I would like to increase my internet data. I'll be glad to help you with that. What's your account number? I don't have my account number with me, but my phone number is 310-865-9274. All right. I see you use our mobile service. Yes, I also have a landline. According to my file, you are eligible for an upgrade to our new service. What does this new service include? It makes the internet connection twice as fast. That sounds perfect. Is there also a price increase? Yes, that will be $5 more per month. Sign me up right away. Asking for credit. Hello, how can I help you today? I'm very upset with the quality of your service. I'm sorry, what seems to be the problem? My internet service did not work for three days. My records say a technician visited your area yesterday. Yes, he installed a new modem. Did it solve the problem? Yes, but I was overcharged for internet service. Sorry about that. I'll give you a credit for the three days. I was sold wireless service unavailable in my area. I see it here. We charged you $5 extra a month. Yes. Kindly return my money, please. Disputing a charge. Hello. Is this the Smith residence? Yes, it is. May I ask who's calling? This is your bank calling in regards to an overcharge on your credit card. I'm sorry, there must be some mistake. It says here that you charged over $500 on it yesterday. That can't be right. I have not used it in months. Are you saying you did not make that charge? That is exactly what I am saying. Looking closer, this charge was made in a different city. I am looking for my card now and I cannot find it. This calls for further investigation. I assure you, I did not make the purchase. Making an appointment. Hello, I'd like to schedule an appointment. Hello, what time would you like to come in? Well, I only like Jane cutting my hair. Jane comes in to work at 3 p.m. today. That sounds perfect. Sign me up. You'll be coming in for a haircut, yes? I'd also like to redo my highlights. That will be no problem. Can I have your name? My name is Sarah. All right, Sarah. We'll be expecting you. All right. Thank you. See you soon. Reporting a service problem. Hello. Please connect me to tech support. This is tech support. How may I help you? I'm having problems with my internet service. What seems to be the problem? None of my wireless devices are connecting to the Wi-Fi. I see. Have you tried disconnecting and reconnecting the modem? No. How do I do that? Simply unplug the modem for 15 seconds. All right. I plugged it in and again. Are all the lights back on on the modem? Yes, they're all green. Your devices should be able to connect easily now. Oh, they're working perfectly. Thank you. Calling credit card company. Hi, I would like to know my credit balance. Of course. May I have your credit card number? Yes, it's 512-879-346. My name is John. All right, John. You currently have no dues on your credit card. Really? I finally paid it off? Yes, sir. Your balance is officially zero. I must admit, I'm proud of myself. Is there anything else you'd like me to check, sir? Yes. Can you change my card status from a college to a normal account? Of course, but you'll have to come into the bank to do that. All right. 
I'll be down first thing tomorrow. Sounds good, sir. Have a good day. Troubleshooting a computer problem. How may I help you? My computer is not letting me run JavaScript. That can easily be fixed. I've tried fixing it myself, but nothing worked. If you'd kindly go to our website, I'll fix the problem. I've logged in. Now what? I will now access your computer from my location. Oh, I see what you are doing. That should just about fix the problem. Thank you so much. It was such an easy solution. I'm happy to help. Again, thank you and have a good day. Ordering services. I'm interested in signing up for your cable service. All right. Please choose the package you'd like. Does this package get me all the movie channels? I'm afraid not. This is the basic package. How much is it for the movie channels? That package is an extra twenty dollars a month. That's going to cost me an arm and a leg. You'll also get the premium sports channels. Well, that does sound tempting. If you sign up for our email updates, I'll give you a discount. All right, I'll take the premium package. You've made a wonderful choice. Hairdressing. Paying for the service. I love my new hairstyle. Beauty takes work. And this is your best work yet. Thank you. I'm glad you're satisfied. How much do I owe you? Well, there was the haircut, and you also got the highlights. Not to mention the lowlights. That'll be forty-five dollars. Prices have sure gone up over time. Yes, but beauty is worth it. When I look this good, I guess you're right. Thank you for letting me cut your hair. Making a complaint. What have you done to my hair? I did exactly what you told me to do. I asked for a light trim, not for a butchering. I had to cut out all the split ends. I look like a grapefruit. My head is too round. It's a short bob, very stylish. It looks more like a bowl cut to me. It looks fantastic. Don't exaggerate. I hate it. I'm not paying for this. You have to pay me for my labor. I'm never coming here ever again. Trust me, you won't be missed. Making requests. Can you cut my hair a little differently this time? Sure. How would you like it cut? Well, last time it was a little too long. I see what you mean. How about a bob cut? Can you work some layers into it? Of course, it's easy. I would also like to keep some bangs. How long would you like them? Maybe down to my eyebrows. Sounds good. I trust you'll make me look beautiful. Oh, trust me, you'll look gorgeous. Doing laundry. Fabric softener. Excuse me, can I borrow your fabric softener? Of course, take as much as you need. Thank you. You're very kind. It's no problem at all. I love the subtle smell of this brand. Me too. It's not overpowering or strong. I think maybe I'll buy it for myself too. What I like about it is that it's hypoallergenic. No kidding. That's really something. It's perfect for washing delicate clothing. Well, thank you for introducing me to this brand. Any time, no problem. Operating a dryer. Put your wet clothes in the dryer, please. How long should I put them on for? Put them on the low heat for thirty minutes. Why low heat? If the air is too hot, the clothes will shrink. I need to wash another load of laundry. 
If they're colored, wash them in cold water. Does warm water make them fade? Yes, put the detergent here and don't use bleach. Oh, that's where to put the detergent. Don't forget to add fabric softener after the first rinse. Okay, I won't. Thanks. Time to do your laundry. I don't have any clean laundry for tomorrow. Well, you should do your laundry then. Laundry is such a hassle. Pack the laundry bags and let's go to the laundromat. Oh, all right. I don't have much, though. Do you have any quarters? Yes, I have enough for the washer and dryer. All right, then. Let's get going. This is going to take forever. The longer you keep complaining, the longer it'll feel. I'd rather be playing video games. I'd rather you wore a clean shirt for school tomorrow. Parents and children. Time for bed. Children, it's time to go to bed. But we're not sleepy yet. If you get into bed right now, I'll read you a fairy tale. One with a princess and a prince? Of course, and a magical dragon, too. Why do we hear fairy tales before bed? So that the magic from stories can grow while you're sleeping. What does it grow into? Why, magical dreams, of course. Please read us two tonight. All right, but only if you sleep as soon as I'm done. We will. It's a promise. Returning a call. Hello, is this Mr. Smith? I'm Mrs. Jones. Hello, Mrs. Jones. Did you get my message? Yes, I did. I'm returning your call. Oh, right. Of course. What's the problem? Is James in trouble? I caught him copying a classmate's test today. Oh, that child is incorrigible. I'm afraid I'll have to give him detention this time. It's all right. I understand. James certainly is strong-willed. Yes, he needs a firm hand and discipline. He's a good boy. Now, if only he'd stop cheating. Caring for puppies. I think these puppies are hungry. They've done nothing but play all day. Do you think they're old enough to eat kibble? They're six weeks old. I think they're old enough. Look, they're digging right in. Now they're settling for a nap. Between keeping them from chewing things and cleaning, they're a hassle. Yeah, they are. But look how cute they are while they sleep. Suddenly, I don't mind the chores so much. Neither do I. These puppies are truly worth it. I wouldn't lose a single minute with them. Waking up for school. Sarah, hurry up and get out of bed. I can't. The blankets won't let me go. Quit being lazy and get up. No, I have to finish my awesome dream. I can't believe you turned off your alarm this morning. Why? I do it every morning. If you don't get out of bed, you'll get to school late. That's not so bad. How is it not so bad? Sleep is good for growing children. Yes, but you have a math test this morning. I completely forgot. I'm up. I'm up. Cooking dinner. What's for dinner? I should be asking you that. What? Why do you say that? You're old enough to cook dinner. Are you saying it's my turn now? Actually, that's exactly what I'm saying. What would you like to eat then? I'm craving some spaghetti, bread, and even a salad. Frozen pizza it is then! You are so lazy. Can you even cook? Of course I can cook. I choose not to. You're having hot pockets for dinner tomorrow. Meeting teacher at school. Hello, Mr. Smith. It's nice to finally meet you. 
Likewise, Mrs. Jones, please sit down. Is James in trouble again? Actually, no, he's not. What's the purpose of this meeting exactly? I just wanted to let you know that James is doing very well. Oh, is that right? I'm so proud. He has been staying for tutoring and his marks have skyrocketed. I always knew he had it in him. He behaves better in the classroom, too. I do believe my James is growing up. All children need to mature is motivation. Cleaning up the room. David, clean your room. It's filthy. It's not so bad, Mom. I don't even remember the, what color the carpet is. It's blue. I remember. Have you no shame? What should I be ashamed of? There are clothes all over the ground. It's just easier to leave them here. Your floor is not a gigantic closet. I never said it was. Clean your room or you can't go out today. Fine, fine. I'll clean it now. An angry parent. You need to try harder in school. I'm doing well in school. Then why are your marks in science so low? I don't understand science, that's all. Is that the same reasoning you have for math? Yes, and English too. Tell me one single subject you're doing well in. Well, I'm doing wonderfully in my music class. What about history? Only the parts about Woodstock. That's it. You're grounded. No guitar for a month. Great. Now I'll surely have a low GPA.